Hey guys, what's up? It's for Card up here, and I'm coming to you with a commentary of Battlefield 4 Rush gameplay on the, one of the new, kind of new maps, um, Operation Metro remade for the PlayStation 4. Um, this commentary is going to be more particularly about um, the is Battlefield 4 worth it, and also is the PS4 worth it. I only have five minutes to discuss this because for some reason, when I tried to convert this video for the, the format for iMovie it only re only went up to like five minutes of recording which is, is kind of aggravating because I really want to give you all the gameplay from this match because I went really good I think I went like 10 and 2 on this and that's kind of hard to do and to pull off on Battlefield itself because of all the, the new grenades and everything but anyway is Battlefield 4 worth it and that goes for the PS3 and I own it on the PS3 too, so I know what I'm talking about when it comes to the last gen consoles. The answer is yes, Battlefield 4 is worth it. Although a lot of people have been complaining about Battlefield 4 and all the bugs and glitches that have been going on in this game, like getting randomly suicided or overpowered guns, which is always an issue in any first person shooter. It's always an issue that are guns being overpowered. It's, it's just a normal part of gaming. There's always going to be an overpowered weapon. But with all that aside, the game is fantastic. There are glitches, and I deal with them because I've been playing Battlefield since 1942. I remember going to my friend's house in the third or fourth grade, and he had Battlefield 1942 on his, his PC. And I remember playing Omaha Beach. The first, I think it was the first map I played, and I remember getting addicted to it, and he even lent it to me once, and my mom saw me throw a grenade at a jeep like two feet away from me and blow it up, and she was furious and actually made me give the game back to my friend, because I was only like eight or nine at the time, <laughs> and it's, it's, I wasn't allowed to play violent games for a while, actually, because my parents raised me right. Listen here, generation, 13-year-old kid should not be playing this game. It's extremely violent. Anyway, the game is very cinematic. Battlefield 4 is extremely cinematic. You got buildings that fall out, skyscrapers that can collapse. You got a map that has a hurricane come in. You have a map that has a dam that floods the whole map if it gets blown up. There's just so much in this game that makes it so cinematic. Especially when you own it on a PC or the new consoles because... On the new consoles, you can have 64 people on one Conquest map. That is a lot of people to have on one map. Because I remember playing Battlefield 3, and the maps were big. And you were only allowed to have a certain amount of people on one map at a certain time. And the big maps kind of kind of got boring at, the, at a certain point because there wasn't enough people going towards one objective. But when you're playing Battlefield 4, you look on the spawn map, you can see red triangles running towards you. And it, it's just so cinematic. Like, you, you get surrounded by... The, the other team it, it's just so cinematic and what also makes it cool is the sound the sounds in Battlefield 4 to me are outstanding they sound like real gunshots I've heard guns I've shot a 12 gauge before and I've heard gunshots so I, I kinda know kinda have the feeling of what gunshots do sound like you and it's not just the guns that make the sounds in this game awesome you hear you can hear mortars blowing up in the distance when you're running towards one spot it, the, when I'm running towards a spot and I hear mortars hitting the ground it it makes it intense because you're like what if one of these things hits me it's kind of cool and the game like I said it's, it's very cinematic and I feel like I'm in uh, I feel like I'm one of the actors in a movie when I'm playing this game and I guess the game should be called Battlefield for a cinematic movie game. <laughs> that's just stupid, but that's the way the game is. Like, it's meant to be cinematic. It's meant to have crazy moments. Like, you could be on one map that has the jets available, and you could be running towards a, pot, a spot on the map and have a jet fly over you. It's so awesome, and the game is worth its money if you give the game a chance and Forget about the bugs that happen, because they you, DICE always fixes them. There are bugs in Battlefield 3 that they fix. Uh, I'm running out of time. I got like 10 seconds. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to give me a, a, a thumbs up, because I like my thumbs up. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to leave a comment and the feedback. I'll be doing more of these soon. Thank you. Fincard up out, and have a nice day.